guys this is my first English video ever so please don't judge me I'm Italian don't judge me I'm going to show you how to recreate this makeup look it's an Arabic inspired look so it's a very sexy winged liner with bold lips and all this stuff here going on glitter and a really bright inner corners because I really like bright inner corners when I have all this black around my eyes and of course the best part is that this is a collaboration with my amazing friend Emanuele Castelli is Italian but he has an English channel it's very famous but if you don't know him please go now check out his channel I will leave I will leave oh my god I will leave the link to his video here down below in the info box his looks are always I mean when I look at one of his makeup I'm always like what you have to check out his channel I promise you you will subscribe for sure Anyway, for this makeup look I use a lot of products by this brand uh, here, it's called Nabla, like that, it's an Italian brand, but this video is not sponsored, I just want to show you these products because they are amazing I love them I really wanted to use them to recreate this look right here and of course it's an entire brand but you can get it because they ship internationally so I will leave you the link in the info box uh, of the website and then okay if you like this makeup look please keep on watching I've already applied my foundation and at the moment I'm using this one by Bourjois, it's the Air Matte. And actually I really like it, this is the third time I'm wearing it because it's really matte, I mean I didn't set it with powder and it's extremely matte. I have a combination skin so in the center of my face it gets very oily but this foundation is super matte I have no oil and I didn't set it so I'm loving it I think that this is the starting of a long happy relationship okay let's move on to the eyes first of all I'm going to prime with my MAC soft oak paint pot this one here and I'm going to use my Sigma P84 brush, but you can use your finger, it's the same. For this look I'm going to use this palette right here, it's by Nabla, an Italian brand, but you can get it because they ship worldwide, so don't worry for that, I will leave the link down below in the info box, and guys, these shadows are Wow, they blend beautifully. I'm going to pick this peach, this matte peach shadow right here. It's called Peach Velvet and I'm going to take a Morphe M433 brush and I'm going to dust this shade all over my crease to create a nice warm undertone. Now I'm going to take this medium brown right here it's a matte shadow again and it's called wild side on a real technique shader brush and I'm going to grab this into my crease to define the shape of my eye I want it to be really cat eye so really elongated and sexy and then with the brush that I used before, the Morphe one, I'm going to blend the edges. Now I'm going to take Peach Velvet again on the same brush because I want to blend this just above the brown shade. With this cream shadow by Nabla, it's called Dandy, I'm going to create a nice 
base on the lid with my fingers for the next color. I'm going to take this glittery color. It's a really unique color. It's called Water Dream and I really like it because it's really sparkly and super super glowy and yeah, I really like it. With the Vanilla Pigment by MAC I'm going to highlight my inner corners. I want them to be really really bright for this look. Now taking a black eyeliner, this one is from Wicon, it's an Italian brand but you can use whatever you want. The most important thing is that the eyeliner has to be really really black and matte and I'm going to create this really elongated wig with a little tail in the inner corners and I'm going to place the eyeliner also underneath my lower lash line but as you can see I'm leaving a gap between my inner corner and this line that I did underneath my lower lash line and then with a black pencil I'm going to line my waterline leaving always the same gap on the lower lash line And for mascara, I'm going to use this Lush Princess Mascara by Essence. It's really cheap, but I like it. Now I'm going to finish up my face. So this is the LA Girl Pro Concealer in Light Ivory. And I'm going to highlight the center of my face. And to blend, I'm using this sponge by Real Techniques. To set my concealer I'm going to use this powder, it's the Fit Me by Maybelline in the shade 120. To bronze up my face I'm going to use this Kiko number no. 5 bronzer with my Morphe M402 brush. I love this brush for bronzer, it's perfect, it blends everything beautifully, I love it. Now I take this palette, this is the Sleek Au Naturel, and I'm going to take this ash grey color to contour my nose with my Morphe M412 brush. Now with a black eyeshadow I'm going to smudge my eyeliner along my lower lash line and I'm using this one from my Morphe 35S palette but any black eyeshadow can do the job. Now time for mascara on my lower lashes, always the false lash mascara by Essence. And for falsies, I want to use the Demi Wispies in Black by Ardell. Now from my Morphe 9B palette, I'm going to take this pink peachy blush, it's matte and I'm going to use my Morphe M462 brush. Yeah, it's finally time to highlight, so I'm going to use my MAC Soft and Gentle and my Morphe M436 brush. For lips I want to use this lipstick always by Nabla and this is called Cosmic Dancer. I freaking love this color. I'm first applying it directly from the tube and then I'm going to refine the edges with a small lip brush. And 
I'm going to tap it with a Kleenex in order to make it matte. Okay guys, this is the final look. As you can see, it's really sexy and dramatic, but I used a bold lip color anyway because I like it and you can use a nude lip color or a gloss if you want, but I prefer going bold with lips at least for this look right here and that's all don't forget to leave me a thumbs up and subscribe and please check out my friend's channel Emanuele Casselli because he is super super amazing and uh, see you in my next video bye guys